Hey, hey everyone. everyone, welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right, guys, we've got a little um, non chicken chicken nugget for you. We've tried a few different ones of these, like kind of fake chicken products, and we really liked the raised and rooted chicken nuggets that we tried. And now today, we are finally trying the Simulate Chicken Nugs spicy version. Now we got these at Target and there's around like 16, 17 nuggets in the box. Packaging is very interesting with this company. It's eye-catching. I don't know if I like it though, but they had the spicy and the regular, but of course we're spicy people, so we opted for the spicy. Yeah, I don't really want to see a chicken um, on the cover of the box because yeah. I don't want to be reminded that it's an animal that I'm eating, you know what I mean? Except like, this is not. Well, you know what I'm saying though. <laughs> That's true. I just, I, I just, this doesn't speak to me. The packaging does not speak to me, but either way, this was around $5. It was on sale. So it's usually a little bit more expensive than that, but we cook these up in the air fryer and this is what we've got. So guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you, if it's worth it. Now it looks like chicken. It does. Do you see that though? There's already like a little like thread type thingies in here. Now we've tried other ones before and yeah. we actually like those. Yeah, we did. I, I feel like the, the idea of fake chicken is always a little hinky, but the execution of it, no pun intended, is usually pretty good. It smells good. Yeah. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, welcome back. Our rating system, thumbs up, we'd buy it again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, it is a thumbs up. If I didn't know, I would think this is real chicken. It tastes good, but it's really, really spicy. It was spicier than I thought it was gonna be. Hmm. I like this though, thumbs up. Okay, I will agree. It is definitely spicier than I thought it was going to be. It actually reminded me of the, the Sam's Club um, yummy, chicken hot fry things that we had. Yeah. Those were super spicy. For me, it's a thumbs down. Um, here's the thing. I like the breading on it. I think that the breading is pretty good. It's almost like a batter type yeah. breading. The inside though is where it kind of got me. Like the flavor is there. It's a texture issue for me though, because the inside of it, pretty much as soon as you start to chew it, it kind of is like mashed potatoes. Like it doesn't have a chicken texture at all and I don't love that. To me, it was a little too mushy whenever you start chewing it and I just don't like that. I would much prefer the raised and rooted if I were to have a fake chicken nugget. I feel like they nailed the texture on that. They nailed the, the breading, the seasonings and flavor and everything. This one, the texture is really, really off. It needs to be a little bit more firm for me. Now, I actually would say this is better than Raised and Rooted. Wow. Now, here's the thing though, they gotta change the packaging. Cause to me, I wanna see a cartoon chicken. I don't wanna see a real chicken on the cover. Just, Maybe that it, is the point. They're it, trying to disgust you to, eat, to not eat chicken, like not eat real chicken. It makes me not wanna eat this though. I will say the chicken does have a pretty little eyeball on it. That's about the only thing I can say about it though. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.